Day one of the RSM Classic is in the books. The tournament has a new title sponsor. An additional course has been added, but it's the same old great scoring, especially with lift clean in place in effect. It's always good news when you don't need the flat stick, as Jim Herman learned on the 18. Roll in, wow. <laughs> Russell Henley also hold it on 17. Do that. Well, <laughs> aggressive chip shot. I guess so. And David Hearn made this look easy on the 12. He's currently one off the lead at six under par. Defending champion Robert Stred made this bomb of a birdie on the ninth. He finished at two under par. Oh, wow. Great way to finish, Robert Streb. Well, Tim Petrovic finished three under on the day, and a couple of those birdies, well, they did not come easily, as he had to make this 30-footer on nine. And wow, good putt. And then a 33-footer on the very next hole. Jason Duffner finished out his round strong with an eagle on the last to jump to five under, just two back. Wow. And no one was better on Thursday than my fantasy pick this week, Kevin Kisner. He put up a seven under 65, which included this eagle on eight. There's an eagle. Wow. Thursday was also special because tournament host Davis Love III played side by side with his son Drew as he made his PGA Tour debut. Both shot even par after 18 holes, but afterwards we learned that Drew did one up his dad in one way. Davis, do you remember 1985, the Georgia Pacific, your first ever PGA Tour event, what you shot that first round? I don't remember what I shot, but I uh, it. We do. Take a look at the screen. That is a two over par number, which means, ah, the kid just said, got him, before we put the microphone in front. So what's it like when you see something like that and you realize that you bettered your dad by a couple of shots today, Drew? Well, if I, if I better him today and I better him the rest of his career, it should be pretty fun, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That'll do it from day one of the RSM Classic. I will see you back here Friday night.